What's up? This is comedian Tim Shropshire right here, along with Miss Minnie here. This is Harmony Lynn, and uh, this is my daughter. She's five months old. Uh, we're coming at you with a vlog, and we're going to do this hopefully weekly, um, capturing um, the process of Tim Shropshire being a full-time entrepreneur. I just left my job, um, stopped working for the state of North Carolina, um, and to do what my heart wants to do full-time. And that's comedy and encouraging people. And so um, I want to do that, and that's what I'm going to do. Um, the, the biggest push, the biggest reason why I want to do this, and especially I had to jump full-time in it, is because um, I felt for me, and this is not for everybody else, but this is for me, um, for me to be effective in what all that God had me to do, I, um, I was not, basically, I was not immersing my entire self in it. I was just doing it. I was a part of it. Um, I was I was every day, you know, working on jokes or working on material and maybe making some contacts, maybe not. Um, now I have to. And I, this was my biggest motivation because I know I, you see what I see. I got a five month old daughter. We don't got millions in the bank. We don't got thousands in the bank. Um, but I have a dream in my heart and a call by God to do this comedy. And um, and we're going to find ways to make it profitable for myself and to be able to help others. So I want to capture um, the next few weeks of me and this new journey. And I believe that it's going to help somebody else and help somebody who just started their journey as an entrepreneur. There are two things that I've learned. One that I learned is um, having a plan. Having a plan so that um, I could be effective. So that I can have priority and purpose to my day. Um, so something that I can be in prayer of. So when my mentor asks me what am I doing, I'm going to pull up my plan and say, this is my plan. This is how we're going to get it. This is something I can submit to God and say, God, is this plan okay with you? So having a general idea of what it is that I'm going to do and how I'm going to do it. Um, something that my wife can see. She's my biggest supporter, but she has to see the plan. So even if we hit Rocky Roads, we say, hey, are we sticking to the plan? Or saying, this plan, um, there, there's, it's, we see that because we have a plan, it's going to take time for this plan to carry out. So there may be some tough moments, but you realize, hey, we still got this plan we're working on, all right? And we can always readjust this plan. But having a plan, having a goal, and actually going after it every day. So in that, going after it every day, the next thing is time management. The biggest thing I learned last week is my first time being away from my job, not clocking in at 8 o'clock and not clocking out at eight at 5 o'clock, was time management. Um, I realized that there's 24 hours in a day, and there's a lot of time there, a lot of time to get things done. But also, there's a lot of time to waste. And you can easily waste time. You can easily, you can easily think you're being productive, but you you count the hours, you count the productive times. You're like, man, that was really just two hours out of 24 hours that I was really working. Okay, so in that plan that you have, how can I maximize that plan in 24 hours? So making sure that I utilize my time each day. So. To my, to, my, to my friends, to my entrepreneurs that are out there, um, this is what I've learned. This is what the people that think about being an entrepreneur. But this is what Tim Shrop Shire has learned. Um, oh. It's just making sure that I have my plan and that right. Having a plan and maximizing my time. This week, we're going to go in some more. I'm going to learn how to. I'm gonna, we're really going to see what does my comedy need? What does speaking need? Well, I'm really going to focus on comedy right now. What does comedy need to be effective? How can Tim Shrop Shire be a worldwide name. We're going to work on that. And I uh, just want to say thank you and keep on tuning in.